Hey guys, welcome to Bad Terrible to the Sweet Charge featuring new Luxury from Crown Zenith with a super cool new explosiveness ability. Let's put this card directly into play as your first active if you have it in your hand while you're setting up to play. So it's a super cool new ability that allows you to skip the evolution, putting a stage 2 card into the active as your first Pokemon. So if you go second, you get to use it as you get to attack on your first turn, doing Seeking Fang for a decent amount of damage, one colorless for 50 damage, and also doing an extra free search. You get to search your deck for any two cards, put it into your hand, reveal them, shuffle your deck, and you also get to play. Uh, we are playing this card with our Vest Queen, searching our deck for Honey. Uh, you know, putting as many Sweet Honey into our hands so that we get to do as much damage with Vespi Queen. Hitting up to 240 damage with our Honey Rush for one Grass Energy, we get to do big damage with this card. We also are playing Radiant Charger Bug to uh, place extra damage control to their Pokemon. Each time they attach energy to their Pokemon V, they are punished by two damage counters. And we also have our Choice Belt as well. Two copies of us do more damage with Honey Rush, knocking out a V Star if they attach one energy and having a Choice Belt on our Vespi Queen. So 270 plus 2 damage counter is enough to kill any V-Star of the board and that's actually perfect math. We also have one Peonia to get our honey from the prize if they get stuck there. We also have one Melotic to help us guard our hand against Marnie, against Judge, and also protect our bench against an Avery. We actually get to have a full bench having Melotic in play. That means they don't actually get to play Avery to discard Pokemons from our bench. We're also playing one Elder Gods to help us search for our energies so that we get to attack with our Honey Rush every single turn and we have also Pokestop that was dig for our sweet honey while also getting our other item cards to evolve or even bench another combi. We are also having one Zorak in this deck to help us transform into either a Melotic, another Elder Ghost, or even another Vespi Queen. We have also our Shaman to do Encouraging Gift, searching our deck for any three cards and putting it into our hand for one colorless. You only get to use this attack if you go second, only on your first turn though. But it does help just in case you don't get Luxury as one of the first seven cards in your hand while you're setting up to play. So for our switch cards, we have one Escape Rope, one Scamana, and one Air Balloon. We also have two Evita, top of social, Melotic, Manaphy, with an extra item card. One Gloria for the basic summon, with four VIP Pass, four Level Ball, and one Capture. One Heavy Ball to get our basics from the prize, and three Incense with two Ultra Balls for the evolution. Finally, we also have one Boss's Order for the Shop Power Play, one Energy Search just in case we have our other cost prized, two Aurora with six basic Grass Energy. So that's all for the decklist, now let's go for some gameplay! Yay, Luxray, wait, you have no basic, would you like to take a mulligan? No, no fucking way. Are we allowed to place another one? Oh no, as your active Pokemon. We're only allowed to play one. That sucks. That kind of sucks, doesn't it? Combi. Are they gonna kill us on the first turn? They need to bench like five Pokemons though. Don't they? We need like two level balls for Elder Goss. I feel like just getting an incense. We should definitely be benching Gossifler with the Ultra Ball. And then search for incense level ball. If we do that, we got only one honey though. Okay, camping gear. Interesting. Only one card though. Probably a Melanie or a water energy. A bucket Melanie. Quick ball. They need a lot though. They need to discard the energy and play the Melanie. And they don't have an energy in the discard pile yet. Okay, we got Elder Goss. That was pretty lucky. Don't think we need the escape rope. 
Okay, we got Gossifler. We actually don't have... Um, we are only playing one copy. So it may be inside... Um, let's just play the Digging Duo right now. It may be inside a prize card. Um, level Ball. <clears throat> Energy. Okay. Should we get level ball? I think we should get level ball though. We've got energy on the next turn. Trainer cards. So let's get Irida. Irida is going to give us the incense. Um, Irida and... I don't think we need anything else. We just need Irida and a honey. We get a honey, right? Pretty sure. We got incense and melotic for Vespi Queen. And that means we just need um Elder Gods for the energy. Free retreat is super nice though. Luxury. One energy attacker, free retreat. Here comes Glaceon. Oh, I feel like just getting... I feel like just getting a Choice Belt right now. I think we should definitely get a Choice Belt. Because we can at least knock out the Suicune. And do... Search for the Incense with Luxury. search for if we have a razor though that's the reason why i like a razor we should be getting pokestop right let's just play it safe we got melotic so they can't actually put cards back now got another vespi queen that's great but pokestop even better okay we're doing 180 damage for two vespi queen and i think we got the win just need to finish off the last one though oh shit we forgot about Menifee. Oh shit. We forgot about Menifee. Oh no. Let's just get everything out first. Okay. No mana fee, aha. Uh -huh. I think we're forced to attack with Luxury again. I don't really want to do that though. Because we just need to hit it twice. <laughs> 80 damage is not going to do much. It, wait, if we have 4 though, 240 plus 80. Oh, it's actually enough. Let's just do it. 240 plus 80 is actually enough. Let's get... Um, Bruno actually doesn't work after having Melotic though. Does it? Let's just do the Rod maybe. I don't even know what to get right now. Choice Belt. Just in case they heal. So we got 240. 270 damage. If they heal like 50 damage, we can't do the knockout. We got no Charger Bog. We got no... Oh, Menifee. Forgot to get Menifee again. Oh, man. We're knocking it out on the next turn, though. If they do a boss, they got double knockout. Um, but still, we have the choice belt, so. Okay, no boss. 
draw four cards though. Why do they bring Bruno? They're playing Bruno for a VMAX deck. That doesn't make sense. Bruno is good for one prize, right? So maybe we should be swapping Bruno for another Irida? <clears throat> This Irida gets us the Menifee, it gets us Melotic. It's actually not bad. Bruno doesn't make sense though, does it? Okay, no boss. We should be attacking with this one, right? I feel like, just in case we don't get a Menifee. Um, we got four. I don't think we need the choice bell. Level ball for charger bug. Do we need the menifee? I don't think Greninja can attack that fast though. It's definitely safer. I don't think we need the... Charge a bug yet. Um, this is actually pretty scary right now. I don't actually know what to get. Okay, we gotta be very careful. One, two, three, four. Okay. They got experience share. It's over though. If they don't kill both the Vespi Queen, it's over. I don't think they can do it in a single turn. Because 90 damage is actually not enough. And we got Menifee already. So, we honestly don't need anything else. They haven't dealt with the Milotic yet. Capture Aroma. Lizard Bonder. Checkmate. It's over. We even got Choice Belt. Just gonna bench another con. Oh shit. We need the Zorok. Oh, we got the Vespi Queen in our hand. Just gonna bench that as well. Should be benching a Charger Bog though. damage. Yeah! We won with Luxray! We got luxury, yay. Put it into your hand, yes.
Um, okay, we just discarded too many stuff. This is scary. Feel like we need energy search now. Hey, how's it going, Momo? Um, heated. Okay, I'll call you heated now. Thanks for joining the stream, heated. Let's get a um, level ball, I guess. Oh, we actually need the honey, though. I feel like we should be getting the honey. I think we need the energy search. So. I'm not playing right. Okay. How's your day? How's your day, Momo? So they're playing Arceus V Star with Ho oh and Arceops. Yeah, I haven't been doing work for a while. Feel really guilty now. I should be doing more work. Haha. <laughs> I'm a very lazy person. We got two combi in the discard pile. That's not good. Is it combi? Combi? Combi. We should be getting an energy though. Like, why are we not getting our energy? Let's just do that um are we able to knock it out 180 i think we got the knockout though so let's just um i'm not sure if i want to discard the net i don't think we should be discarding the net but we might not get the energy though i don't think we have a choice honestly Um, oh shit, we can't actually get the Vespi Queen. Oh my god, what are we gonna do? I feel like we need too many things. We need the Milotic, we need the Zorok, we need the Energy. I sent you the list. Uh, uh, give me a second. Potential cards to use with Revile. On Insta, just a job. Okay, I'll have a look at it. If you can, um, we kind of have to post new cards though. Like if we don't post new cards on YouTube, we won't be getting views. So if you have any suggestion for, um, fun cards to play with from Crown Zenith, I would be all, all in. Weavile, I'm not so sure if it's, um, gonna work with new cards. I'll try my best. I have to finish this one first though. I have to finish up my um, luxury deck first. I'll check out the insta real quick. Um, after I finish up this one. Oh man, I don't know what to do now. We got the energy. Don't have the choice belt. We need like the rod though. We better get the Zorak first. Um, I don't think we need the air balloon. Okay, we got nothing. Pokestop is just not giving us anything. <clears throat> if 
50 damage is exactly enough though on the next turn. Seeking fangs, enough to knock it out. Wait, yep. Basic energy though. Ho oh, oh is doing like basic, right? It's doing only 120 damage, 130 damage. Because they have one basic energy. Let's just do tracking shoes first. Um, put this card into your hand, yes. Oh my god. That sucks. What do we even search for? We need the rod. Don't have a heavy ball. Do we just get the Vespi Queen? We have the Vespi Queen. I just realized that. I think we need more Zorok. Peony is gonna get us the combi. Uh, the rod. Apparently we don't have the combi. Oh my gosh. We need the fucking rod now. I think one more Zorok is gonna help. Maybe we should be playing more supporter cards. I feel like just doing a Reizu. Two more supporters. Yeah, we don't really have enough supporters. We got like one Irida, one Bruno. One ticking duo, one PO. Which is pretty sad, isn't it? Um, we're gonna get the rod out. I don't know what to quick ball though. Oh wait, we have to do this first. Um Shit, we should have just played Pokestop first. That was quite stupid. Uh, I feel like two combi. Two energy. One energy. Oh man, we should have played the Pokestop first. That was really, really stupid. And they just discarded Milotic. <laughs> oh well. Um, level ball. Incense? We got incense already. Tracking shoes. Sonia. Um, 
Don't really know what to do right now. There's no point in getting either. Um, I'm just trying to dig for that. Oh my gosh. We just need 50 damage. Okay. Realizing... That I may not need that after all. We don't even have a boss. Oh man, we could have gotten the energy though. That's... That kind of sucks, doesn't it? If they attack with Ho, oh, we're done. Oh man, we could have gotten the energy with the tracking shoes first. Oh my god, this sucks. gonna get the energy oh thank god <laughs> this is like a really bad drag right now not even any logic in play that's terrible I wanted to get some juice first. Oh wait, I have some juice here. Yay, we got Lux Ray. Um, I don't know what to do right now. What do we even search for? <coughs> Trainer card. Gloria. Gloria is a lot better, right? I'm thinking of doing one Arezu. Because we may have too many... Incense. Oh, we should be getting Irida though. Forgot about Irida. Shit. I keep forgetting about Irida. What's what the fuck is wrong with me? I feel like Gloria would help us more though. Should have just done Irida Pokestop. Pokestop for level balls. It's a, oh, it's a darkness though. We're hitting for twice as much damage. Playing a bug type. How many, um, we got three Vespi Queen, which should be fine. No Elder Goss, but we got Peonia. <laughs> That's how we get Elder Goss with Peonia. If we don't, we're gonna be so screwed. Um, Milotic? Just gonna put into our hand first. Let's hope we don't discard the wrong ones. Um, now we're gonna get what are we gonna get now? Irida's not gonna help anymore. 
I don't know what to get actually. So they got wheezing. We need the energy though. I feel like we still need the energy search. Oh my god. Boss? Tracking shoes. Let's do tracking shoes actually. We got one honey in the prize. Are you kidding me? I don't know what to do honestly. We need the energy search. Oh man. We have to reveal it? Really? Reveal them and put them into your hand. Okay. Oh no, it's already a V-Star. We just need 150 damage though. So we honestly just need the energy. I feel like we should swap this for energy search now. This Elder Gods is not always possible. Tracking shoes for energy search would make a lot more sense, right? Do they have enough to kill the Luxray though? <clears throat> they need the Dark Patch. Oh, they got two Dark Patch. They got the... V star power. Even got the other wheezing. They got more than enough. They need two more energies though. But they got double dark patch, so. Moltres. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six. That's more than enough. Oh, man. Kinda sucks. I got air balloon. Let's do air balloon on the melodic. Energy, yeah, we got Elder Gauss. Okay, don't need that, don't need that, don't need that. I don't think just gonna put Escape Rope Digging Duo VIP. talking another combi or another Zoro I don't know I have no idea let's just do Zoro they may just kill the Milotic on the next turn so the 180 damage should be enough right No weakness guard. Um, do you need to do anything else? Nope. Yeah. Oh, they just conceded. <laughs> oh, we won against a dog cry. Animals rock. No, they don't.
Bot match. It's a robot. I should have played an Irida. That was really stupid. Forgot to use Irida. an old price card. Oh no, I forgot our price card is getting lost. Then. Weak to us grass type, we should have retreated on the last turn. 
Oh, thank God. <laughs> Not actually enough Twenty damage. Hey Gazer Beam, how's it going? Smooth name, yo, Gazer Beam. Um, I don't know what to get. Good to hear. Oh man, we need it. What do we need? We need the rod, I think. It's gonna transform right now. Let's transform later. What kind of a weird deck are we playing against right now? Oh man. Are they gonna do another boss? Okay. Oh, they, oh man. Oh, we got escape room. Um. Okay. 
Okay. Got flop for 30 30 damage. I thought it's 20 damage. Thirty damage is hardly enough, though. Oh man, this kind of sucks. Oh man. No, how many switches do you have, yo? the fucking rod We didn't play the Irida. If we played the Irida on the first turn, oh my god, that was so stupid, yo. On the second turn. Oh, thank god. Capture. I don't think we have any more basics. Pretty sure we have no more basics though. Finally got the goddamn bloody rod. I don't know what to search for though. Shuffle back. I feel like we have no choice but to shuffle back. <clears throat> we can't actually do back the combi. We got no more Vespi Queen. <laughs> We got one more Vespi Queen, but I'm not sure where it is. Oh, it's in the active. Wait, we got one more though. Is it inside the deck? Should we shuffle back the Menifee? Or the Shaman? I don't think we have any more Vespi Queen. I think this is the last one. One, two, three. Where is the... Oh, we have three. We, only... we are only playing three copies. I'm just realizing that. We only have three copies. Okay, let's just kill off the goddamn Glisker. With two stone energies. 320 damage. Oh my god, we got two prize remaining though. Are we seriously gonna lose to this guy? Yikes. We just need a boss or something. We don't have a boss anymore. This kinda sucks. Oh 
my gosh. If we have the linear attack. If we have the linear attack, I think we would have won. <laughs> 30 damage. Could have killed the Barbarical. Oh, man. We should have healed, though. We should have healed with one of the honeys. Why didn't I heal just now? Oh my god, I wasn't expecting the farfetch. We should have expected the farfetch though. We could have done so many things. Like, I don't know what's wrong with me. Oh, thank god. If they paralyze us, we're done as well. There we go. We're gonna play one. Just for the recovery. Oh my god, what is happening right now? And then we're gonna honey rush for 320 damage. 360 minus 40. So, we're gonna play Aurora now. That was actually pretty close. <laughs> so, I think that's all for the decklist. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Today, we have our Sweet Charge coming at you fresh with Luxray from Crown Zenith. Doing Seeking Fang for a free search, double search. Uh, you get to uh, dig out any two trainer cards from your deck and put it into your hand. Reveal them. Uh, shuffle your deck, but you actually get to do 50 damage as well for one colorless, which is super cool. The main strong point, the main priority is that we actually get to put this card directly into play, skipping the evolution if we have it in our hand before setting up to play. And that means if you draw it as the first card, uh, as the first seven cards in your hand, you actually get to put it as your first active Pokemon and use this attack for free for your first, uh, first turn if you go second or on your second turn if you go first. And then we also have our Shaman to do Encouraging Gift if we, for some reason, are not able to get Luxury as our first hand, which is actually pretty difficult though, because you're not allowed to search for this card before putting it as your first active. You actually have to rely on Chance for it to show up as your, uh, you know, as your first active inside your hand uh, when you first draw the seven cards into your hand. So if you don't have that, if you don't have a Luxury in your hand, before actually uh, playing any card, you're not allowed to search for it and then put it onto your bench. You're not allowed to skip the evolution with its ability unless if you get it in your hand before you set up to play. And we have Shaman just in case we can't play uh, Luxury as we said. So Encouraging Gift allows you to um, search your deck for any three cards put into your hand. If you go second and you only get to use this attack on your first turn though, so you're not actually allowed to play this attack. After your first turn, it's important to know that this is only a first turn going second move that you get to play for free. Triple search, which is a lot better than Luxray, honestly, because you get to search for any card. You get to search for Irida, you get to search for energies, you get to search for anything in addition to, uh, you know, you know all, not just your trainer cards. And we also have Milotic to keep our hand to make sure we don't get Marnie. If they play a Judge, Milotic gets to... Uh, you know, block that effect as well. Milotic also gets to block Avery from forcing us to cut off our bench. And that means we get to keep our 5 full bench. We, we get to keep a full bench while having Milotic in play. We also have uh, 3 copies of Vespi Queen, which is the main combo for this deck. We want to be using our Seeking Fang and also Encouraging Gift to search for as many Sweet Honey into our hand as possible. So we get to do a maximum of 240 damage with Vespi Queen. Doing Honey Rush for a big knockout. So we are not actually able to kill a V-Star with one hit. But that is why we have our Raiden Charger Bug to add extra damage counters on their Pokemon each time they attach energy onto their V-Stars. They are punished by 2 damage counters and that means we just need 270 damage to knock it out with our Choice Belt. And having 4 copies of Sweet Honey in our hand. How do we get all 4 copies though if we don't have one inside the deck? If we have at only 1 copy in the prize, it's still actually not enough to kill a VMAX. Sorry, a V-Star. So we actually need Peonia to dig out those honeys from the prize or even our one copy uh zorak we're only playing one copy of that and one melodic as well if we have it prized we actually get to dig it out with our peonia we also have one copy of elder gods double search for our energies we have one energy search as well instead of tracking shoes we are swapping that for energy search now uh with our it actually works really well with our pokestop helping us dig for our item cards so that we actually 
are able to search for energies using our item rather than only relying on that one copy of Elder Gods to dig for the energies. So for the energies, we're playing 2 Aurora, 1 Capture, and 6 Basic Grass. Capture doesn't actually work for Vespi Queen because you need a Grass energy. But Aurora, the reason we have that is because we can actually attack. We can target their bench. If they don't have a Mana Fee, we can target a bench with Linear Attack, drawing 2 prizes for a V-Star knockout if they retreat to the bench. Having like 30 HP remaining, or like 20 HP remaining after we did our Honey Rush on the previous turn. Uh, while attacking with a new Pokemon, we can actually target the same Pokemon on the bench by knocking out a V-Star for uh you know for two prize or even three prize by killing a v max so that's the power of raiding charger bug and that's why we have our aurora energy just because charger bug requires a lightning and we are only playing grass for this deck since we need vespi queen to attack and for our basic summon we have four v pass four level ball uh one capture with one gloria we also are playing two Irida to get our um melodic phoebus slash menifee into play and also one honey or even uh, incense, air balloon, what have you. We have three Pokestop to get our item cards to dig for them. One boss, one digging duo just in case they play a Marnie early before we get our Melotic. If they play a Marnie, we at least get to dig back out a honey into our hand by using this special new supporter card from Crown Zenith. We get to search any uh, for any one card. Uh, you know, look at the top, look at the bottom eight cards of your deck. If you flip a head, if you flip a tails, you're only allowed to look at the bottom three cards of your deck and put any one card into your hand. So it's a super fun card to play uh, for post rotation as well. And we also have um, one Rod to shove back our Pokemon energies, one Zorak to uh, transform into either Melotic or our Vespi Queen. And I think that's all for the deck list. Don't want to go on too long. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. We'll see you next time. Have a great day and bye, fun, people. Enjoy your life!